So this is our third annual Care and Share for Autism Ladies Day. And once again, it's a spectacular day. We've got so many sponsors on board again, and the support has just been very overwhelming. Um, we've got our Skin Correctives team here again today doing brow designs. We've got South Coast Academy here um, sponsoring us the foot massages as well as the head massages. We've got the beautiful ladies from Mary Kay doing hand spa treatments. We have um, the hair lounge doing hair, making faces, doing makeup and Inner Edge Wellness again on board doing the neck and shoulder massages. We've also got crystal bowl therapy, meditation, beading, scrapbooking, drumming. Um, we'll also have some belly dancing this year. We have Aboriginal art and much, much more. So it's an absolute fantastic day. The ladies are having a wonderful time and it's just so rewarding for us all to see. So uh, Inner Edge Wellness has been one of the gold sponsors of Care and Share for the last two years. Last year was our first year and really loved being a part of it. I'm really lucky because I have local massage therapists actually volunteering their time today. Uh, and one of the things that I really love about Care and Share is the, the way that the women and the carers and the parents, their face light up, that they're actually getting a day to actually pamper themselves when more often than not, they're not the priority. They're putting their kids first. So it's just a really awesome day to be a part of. We've got two children on the autism spectrum, Cameron who's 14 and Kobe who's 12 and um, I just know how important it is as a mum to be, take care of yourself and to make sure that you put some time aside for you because it, it, this is a marathon not a sprint so we do need to make sure that we fill up ourselves so that we can give, um, be the best mum that we can be and we can give our, of our best to our children. It's an event I've always looked forward to coming to. Um, it just makes you feel that little bit pampered and um, like something that you don't usually get to do. Um, the beading, I found a nice and re a re relaxing activity to do. I wouldn't mind trying the belly but dancing that's on today too, but that, that'll be fun. <laughs> Uh, this is my third year, so I love coming here because I see that these ladies have a day of pampering, to have a day of uh, peace and quiet with harps and massages and head facial massages, and it's just something that you're giving back to the community. They have they have little time for themselves, so this is a day where they get to have time for them, and that I think is important. Well, I have a six-year-old child on the autism spectrum and I just thought that it was a great idea and it's something that I think we really benefit from and enjoy and yeah, it's nice to be spoiled. My daughter is Stephanie, she's 26 years old, uh, very high on the autism scale, non-verbal. Um, to have a pamper day, um, it's special and I'm meeting other mums that are similar with situations so I think it's good. I've had my eyebrows shaped which was lovely, very relaxing. I've had my uh, feet and head and shoulders massage, very relaxing and pampering and I'm about to have um, a hand exfoliation and massage, looking forward to that. Okay, well, I have three boys and my middle child, Hayden, is on the autism spectrum um, and he's eight. Um, well, I've heard about today on Facebook. Today I got my hair done and that was probably my favourite. And I also got my professional photo taken, which was really, really nice. I've never done that before. And um, I had my makeup done and yeah, I'm also booked in for a hand and foot massage. So it's really exciting. Well, as a speaker, I speak obviously at a lot of conferences and events, um, but I was especially excited to be asked to speak at this particular event because it's an event close to my heart because I too have a son living with autism and so I know that we give so much of ourselves that we get so exhausted and every now and again it just needs to be about filling us up and um, nurturing us because you can't give what you don't have and in the end we've got to give to ourselves first. So that's why I'm particularly excited about um, adding a little sparkle to your fantastic day here today. This is uh, my second year at Care and Share. Um, I do the event photography for the day, so I take photos of all the ladies doing their beardology and their scrapbooking, um, having their massages, and generally them relaxing and having a nice time. I love being in involved with Care and Share because um, it brings the community together a bit more. 
and um, it has peop- everyone who is like-minded and supporting each other through something that can be um, it can be a tough life. And you know, if, if I can help those people in some some small way, then that gives me a really good feeling. Hello, so, uh, hi everyone. My name is Mark King. Um, we're um, uh, building a resilience tree here today, and it's absolutely amazing. We just wanted to share some some art with people, and um, I'm an Aboriginal person, and I love um, I love art, and um, I like uh, uh, bringing the contemporary art into 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 healing places, and and we want to be part of uh, Care and Share, just so we can actually. I know, um, give back to people because so many people have given to us and our family in our little journey with our child with um, on the spectrum. Um, I've recently been invited to become the Secretary of Care and Share for Autism. So as part of that I've volunteered for today's event and after seeing what goes on through this event and being on the raffle table and being able to personally interact with the women that are coming here, it's just amazing. It's just, I actually find it really moving. I've been working on the roulette raffle table today and where women who have raffle tickets or purchase raffle tickets can actually choose the gift that they would like to win or the prize they'd like to win. And what I've noticed, which has touched my heart a little, is the fact that many of those women have chosen to have a night away because one of the prizes is a night away in a hotel in Wollongong and it just shows how much these women really need respite and a, a 24 hour break from the matters that they have to deal with in their own homes. Hi, my name's Cassandra and I'm an Australian artist. I'm on the autism spectrum along with the rest of my family. I have two sons with Asperger's and I have Asperger's too. And I'm here because I I want to help promote the idea that the word disability doesn't quite cover it because with the autism spectrum comes a whole lot of gifts that aren't always apparent immediately and you don't have the chance to expose them or find them without the support and the assistance of others. So I'm here today to show that it can be done and I'm here because I've helped care and share uh, by being their guest speaker in the last two years and I'm happy to be here as an artist to show that people on the spectrum have many multifacets that need a chance to develop and grow. It's an absolute fantastic day. The ladies are having a wonderful time and it's just so rewarding for us all to see. Hi, it's Paul here from Paul's Productions. Paul's Productions is proud to be a platinum sponsor and media partner for the second time. Uh, for Care and Share for Autism Ladies Day in the Illawarra. Video is the most engaging medium for anyone or any business to share your story uh, and tell your story. And uh, today we're just finishing off, putting finishing touches on the video that we made at the Ladies Day uh, a couple of weeks ago. Um, we will be able to share the stories of the mums who uh, are living with family um, affected by autism and the experiences that they um, shared and enjoyed through this wonderful day. Um, we'll share the stories of the other sponsors, how they also enjoy providing these services to these, uh, these mums and these families. So again, it's a privilege for us to be a sponsor and a media partner for Care and Share for Autism. Thank you.